Good morning, Shelley. Well, the Inner Harbor is known for its tourism and its many restaurants. But for those who live and work in the area, many say the fear of violence just seems to never go away. And that proved itself true on Thursday night when police say they exchanged gunfire with someone who shot at them. Now, police say the man behind the shooting was 35 year old Benjamin Tyson of Baltimore. He ran to a nearby parking garage where officers approached him. And that's where police say Tyson pulled out a gun and tried to shoot at officers, but the gun misfired. Tyson was killed by return fire. The shooting has rocked those who live in the city and work in the city, especially small businesses like restaurants who have been struggling to survive due to the financial impact of COVID-19. Many business owners at the Inner Harbor have long complained about crime in the area, and business owners fear the perception is hurting their reality. If the downtown is viewed as violent, then your visitors will come, uh, and that has all kinds of negative economic implications for jobs, commercial real estate values, the tax base, uh, and the reputation of this city. It's bad enough that people are afraid to come there because it's a pandemic. And it's doubly worse if they think there's crime. And according to police, crime is not on the rise in the area, they say. In fact, they insist that it is decreasing and credit an army of additional officers now on patrol. We're live in downtown Baltimore this morning. Joseph Ojo, Fox 45 Morning News.